guys, it's Full Cuts here, live and direct from Brooklyn, New York, and in front of me today, the Natan Natan 2000 Upper Deck Wayne Gretzky Hockey Hobby Box, guys. Turning back the clock, dialing a Gretzky stock on the old Juke Box. Here we go, guys. Uh, so this was, of course, his retirement year product. Of, there aren't necessarily hits in here, unfortunately. It's just sort of a cool product to break. I don't think there's many boxes, so I thought I'd hit this product. Uh, why not? So configuration, eight cards per pack, 24 packs per box, 192 cards. Total base set, one through 180. And there would happen to be 12 rookie cards within this product. Uh, no parallels, as far as I know. And with regard to inserts, I think we should receive 24 of the Hall of Fame career uh, inserts, which are every pack, four of the elements of the game, 1.85 of the will to win, 89% chance at the changing the game, another 89% chance at great heroes, and 14% at those cool visionary cards. Uh, mems, almost none. I think there's maybe 17 to 20% chance at hitting a mem. Uh, Tools of Greatness relics are, in fact, 17%. Uh, there is a great memorabilia, Gretzky Puck, but it's one card on the checklist and there's only 10 cards. So obviously it's 1% or less, depending on the amount of boxes. Uh, there are the 500 Gold Club, which you have probably seen in other products and auto versions up to 25. And I hear that there are some signs of greatness uh, theoretically within this product as well. So let's uh, crunch it. Old school plastic here. Um, very old school plastic. Thick, disgusting plastic. And in terms of rookie cards, guys, a nominal checklist, I believe there's only 12 rookies within this product, two rookies, um, including Patrick Stefan, John Graham, Brian Campbell, uh, Sabrikin, Johan Hex, I think, is also within this product. All right, so here are the packs. And that's kind of cool. Look for tools of greatness. Uh, look for tools of greatness memorabilia cards. All right. Uh, what a treat to open up another old school product. And uh, let's do it, guys. Uh, these might stick a bit, so we have to watch out for that. So there's Brendan Shanahan. There is Dougie Gilmore. Uh, cool, Joe Thornton, second year card, I imagine. And there's Peter Sakura, Ryan Smith. Uh, unsung hero card. It's an unsung hero card of Rob DeMaio. Just looking to see where that is on the checklist. I guess it's just a base card. Oh, I see what it is. Different, they have different nomenclature at the bottom of them. So the rookies would be also denoted at the bottom. Uh, two inserts in this pack, guys, that's great. So we hit the changing the game and this is an awesome Al McInnes card, wow. And here would be our first uh, Gretzky uh, Hall of Fame card. Uh, really nice shiny looking card. So we had an 89% chance at hitting that changing the game card. So that would be our only one of the entire box, uh, ostensibly. Continuing on, guys. Here's Pierre Turgeon. There's Mike Richter, I love it. Uh, Cujo. And here's a prospect card, Brad Stewart. Uh, there's Alfredson. There's another prospect, Randy Robitaille. And again, uh, two hits in this one. I say hits, soft hits, obviously. Elements of the game. So we hit an elements of the game, nice. So we received four of these. Uh, it's a pretty handsome looking card right there. It's funny, I'm looking at it and I was like, is that Barnaby or is that Pekka? I don't know why in my mind I confused the two. And a, an awesome Wayne Gretzky uh, all-star card. So the 1999 draft, we remember that Stefan went first, although it didn't amount to that much. And it was Daniel Sedin and Henrik Sedin that went uh, second and third, but they are not in this product. Uh, Sabrikin is, and he went 11th in Nantan, Nantanan. Continuing on, guys. So there's a Rob Blake, another prospect of Tongue. Uh, unsung hero of Mark Savard. It's, you know, it's funny how they have nomenclature. Guy Bear, uh, Langenbrunner, Brunette, and a Steve Korea. So this would be a rookie. This is our first rookie, the Steve Korea, Paul Korea's brother and uh, an, another awesome uh, Hall of Fame one of Wayne. All right, let's go. So Steve Korea only plays 65 NHL games, unfortunately, and I believe he was undrafted, unlike his bro. Uh, continuing on, and we have a pa Pavel Dimitra, uh, Hosa, Paul Fee, a 
Slaney, I think it's I think it's a Slaney. La Flint, La Perriere, a Bates Battaglia, and a pretty cool one, Wayne Gretzky, uh, with the oil. So I, I do believe there are some hyper rare autos, so that's a potentiality. Mike Medano, Bure, uh, Steve Ruchin. Oh, something, that's interesting. There's something behind here. Huh, a piece of debris within the pack, okay. Uh, Marcus Naslin, we have a leaders of Berard, um, Morozov, and this one here would be <laughs> a baby waner. Uh, pretty cool. This is a cool uh, checklist, this one. We received 24 of the 30 cards on that Hall of Fame career checklist. Okay, so we have a Yari Hager, uh, Kenny Johnson, uh, Mike Greer, every which way, Corey Stillman, uh, Chris Stitch, and Travis Green, yeah, Coach Green, and here is another Wayne Gretzky. Chris Drury, Miro Chatan, Marlowe, Eric Lindros, uh, Tim Conley, prospect card, Tim Pody, and a Brian Campbell. So we actually get the Brian Campbell rookie. That's pretty decent. And another really cool Gretzky card. I mean, Brian Campbell, he was on one of the uh, Stanley Cup teams with Chicago and was an all-star. Uh, a lot of people don't remember how good he was. He was uh, pretty tremendous. Uh, there's Saka Koivu, nice. Uh, Kapanen, and Pavel Patera, Ian Modine, Dan Briere, Sheldon Sure. And we have two inserts again, which is always a good thing. And we did hit one of these um, elements of the game. Uh, A.R. Jagger, and look at this Gretzky. That's a cool looking photo. Just a Hall of Famer, one per pack. Fun product, uh, not easy to get your hands on it anymore, um, but I recommend it, of course. All right, Kelly Bookberger, Chris Pronger, Radic Bonk, Luke Robitaille. Um, yeah, <laughs> there's Nikki Lidstrom, Kyle McLaren, uh, Jan Bulis, and look at this, Gretzky with the Sioux Greyhounds. Uh, does it have his points with the Sioux Greyhounds? Put up almost 200 points with them, 182 with the Sioux. I mean, it said we had what, four, 500 uh, point seasons, just a monster is Wayne. Okay, Brett Hall, of course, Bill Housley, Tima Solani, uh, Steve Shields, Manny Maholtra out of Mississauga, Jeff Hackett, I know that because I have friends who went to school with him. Uh, here's a will to win. And it's a cool Matt Sandin sparkly card. And here is Gretzky ostensibly right at the end of his career. McGillney, uh, Alitalo. I thought this was, I thought he was a rookie. Maybe he's not. Um, Scott Niedermeyer, Dougie Waite, Eric Daze, uh, Trevor Notsky, a Joe Sacco. And another great one. I think Campbell also won a Lady Bing, did he not? Joe Sackick, Dominator, Friesen, uh, Al McInnes Leader Card, uh, Peter Nedved, uh, Aki Berg, Keith Primo, and another one of these Hero Cards, or Hall of Fame Cards, sorry. Ideally, we get a thick card, but I think, as I said, it's a case hit, so. All right, Jeremy Roenick. Marty Brudeur, Chris Chelios, Kyle Calder, who's a rookie. So Kyle Calder, Calder's definitely a rookie. Sergey Krukasov or something to that effect. Um, Adam Denmarsh, who I just hit in the other box. Jeff uh, Nielsen and another Wayne Gretzky Hall of Fame card. Ray Bork, Vinny Le Cavalier, Johnny LeClaire, um, Chris Gratton. I hate when all the cards are in different directions. Mark Recchi, makes it so hard. Uh, Brennan Morrison, and here we go, guys. So we have another elements of the game. If you can read that, it's really hard to read, but it says Peter Bondra, right? I'm assuming that says Peter Bondra. 
Uh, and another one of the Gretzky's is nice at the, net, at the side. Ron Tugnut, <laughs> Stefan Fissette, who's an, uh, an analyst now, Grant Fuhrer, Eddie Belfour, uh, this is absolutely the goalies pack. Uh, Volchkoff, he's a rookie. Uh, leader of Vinny Donfus, we have a Joey Juno, and we have another Wayne Gretzky Hall of Fame card. Tons of packs in these old products, it's just relentless. Here's Brian Savage, I remember number 49. Uh, Joey Neuendijk, Ron Francis. We have Sergey Fedorov. Uh, we do have a rookie here of John Graham, so we hit the John Graham rookie card, that's nice. Uh, he's the one I guess I wanted to hit, of course. Uh, Garth Snow, didn't mention it, but it's true. And there's a will to win of Patrick, who obviously had the will to win. Heart of fire, did he? And there is a nice, like, 1981 uh, version of the uh, All-Star game. So here's another leader, and it's Damien Rhodes. And we have a Matt Sundin, we have a Rod Brandenmore. We do have a leader, Peter uh, Scudra. Mathieu Biron, uh, Kozlov, and here's the Oleg Saprikin. So there you go, uh, 11th overall. And our man Wayne Gretzky. So we hit all the rookies, but it's because they're all base cards by definition. There you go. So there's David Leguan, uh, Stevie Y, Arthur Urbe with the ugliest helmet on the planet, uh, Samsonov, uh, Andre Zuzin, a prospects of Simon Gagné, a leader of Mike Dunham, and a awesome one of the Wayne Gretzky with his St. Louis Blues for those five minutes of fame. That's the Beezer. Um, we have Mike Johnson, we have a Scott Stevens, who I just hit in the other box, Gary Fisher, uh, Emerson, Steve Thomas, Bob Senza, I know his brother, um, and there's Wayne Gretzky. So Bob Asensa's brother um, runs elections, or did run elections in Ontario. Probably still does. I work for him directly, actually. That's why I feel so strongly about the integrity of elections. So here's the Patrick Stefan. So we hit the Stefan, which is the number one overall, but that was bound to happen. Uh, we have a Cujo. We have a Weinrich. Weinrich. We have a Zamnov. A pretty cool Matt Cullen as well as an Elements of the Game. Oh, three hits in this box. How nice is that? So Elements of the Game of Eric Lindros, a Great Heroes, of, that would be Solani, I guess, and there is a Curry Gretzky Hall of Fame card. So the Great Heroes would be a maybe 9% chance, so basically one per box. All right, Keith Kachuk, Wayne Gretzky, Chris Osgood, uh, Monty, uh, Adam Oates, Jan Hecht. Uh, Jan Hecht, is he a rookie card? I thought he was in this product. And a Kamensky, as well as Wayne Gretzky. So yeah, Jan Hecht, even though it isn't stated as a rookie, was in fact a rookie. I can guarantee you that uh, 49th overall in 1995, Johan Hecht. Uh, that's one I just did from memory. Uh, so Jason Allison, uh, Kovalev, uh, Brian Leach. I mean, I look a lot of these things up, you know, so I'll remember them. Trevor Linden, uh, JP Dumont, uh, Mark Parrish, and a Schaefer, and then of course another one of the Hall of Fame cards. This looks almost post-career, doesn't it? Two packs left, guys. Scott Mellenby, a Peter Forsberg, a Michael Pekka, Paul Correa, a Roman Turek, another goaltender pack. And there's Bobby Lou, a early Bobby Lou. Uh, I don't think this is considered a rookie card for whatever reason, a true one. Stumple, and there is Gretzky with St. Louis and with Hull. I mean, we should lobby for that to be considered a true rookie card. Um, I hate the fact that Becky decides these things, but you know, he did begin his career in 1999 uh, with the Islanders for uh, that one year, so really should be a rookie card. Uh, Kolzig, a Herdina, uh, Adam Graves, and a, a Tanabi, a Sergey Berezin. There is JJ Daniel, who was uh, on the Habs uh, Cup winning team. There's Patrick Iliash. And our last card, guys, would happen to be this uh, beautiful one of Wayne, another one of Wayne. 
All right, guys, time for the recap. Really quickly, I'm gonna just blow right through it. Uh, we did, in fact, receive two stacks of this stuff. It's the base cards. They're actually pretty uh, nondescript, pretty clean looking, uh, dated base cards. Uh, there's Cujo. Uh, and it's the Cujo checklist. The last card on the checklist is the checklist. Uh, that works out well. Bang. And we did in fact receive all 12 uh, true rookie cards. And I'm gonna add a rookie to the mix just because. But there's Cal Calder, they're just all of them. They're all there. Saprikin, Johan Hecht. Uh, yeah. Uh, Brian Campbell, Stanley Cup winner, John Graham. Uh, Steve Korea. And there's Patrick Stefan, first overall, 1999. And there's Roberto Luongo. And everybody's going to say he's not really a true rookie. Uh, his true rookie card is such and such because I read it in Beckett. Uh, I'm calling him a rookie because it was his first year. He was first overall in 1997, but his first year in the NHL was, in fact, 1999. And I know people are going to implode because they have these notions of purism, but I'm not that guy. And we received all 24 of the Hall of Fame cards, and they're all Wayne Gretzky cards. They're really cool looking cards from different eras of his career and life. Just beautiful stuff. I love that one. I don't know why I like the goalie net because I'm a goalie. And there he is with the Sioux Greyhounds. Can you imagine that? The Sioux Greyhounds? That year back in 77, 78, I think he played 64 games, and uh, he put up 70 goals in those 64 games and 112 assists. So that's like almost 200 points. It's like 182 points when he was with the Sioux. Uh, all alone, away from home, poor kid. And we were guaranteed four of the elements of the game. We see four. There's Bondra, there's Jagger, there's Lindros, there's Michael Pekka. Uh, 40th overall in 1992, was he? The two-time Selkie Award winner, Michael Pekka. Guaranteed 1.85 of the wills to win, and we did receive two. There's Sandine, and there's my man, first all-time in Cons Mice, with three. That'll never be beaten by a goalie. I love it. There's Patrick Watt. And we were guaranteed almost one each of these things. So here's the changing of the game. Al McInnes, really cool. And there is a team of Solani, who of course is first all time of points for a Finn. Imagine that with 1,457 points. Uh, Timo Solani, the man, the legend, the master. Uh, there you go. So that's basically it guys. Uh, could not hit a case hit, but I can always be a winner winner on Simmer, um, you know. So please be sure to sub like and hashtag drive and I have a full cards live and direct from a place called Brooklyn, New York.